All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. It's great to have you guys here. Hope you guys have been having a wonderful day. In today's video, we're going to be going over the current Disgaea RPG JP celebration. We just finished off the 1.5 stuff, so now we've moved on to this new celebration. I'm going to be going over all the details so that way you guys can know what's going on on the JP side, as always, so that way you guys know what's coming in the future. So that's what we're going to be doing in today's video. So if you guys are enjoying the content, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button for more Disgaea RPG content, news, and all that jazz. Again, it's great to have you guys here. Hope you guys have been having a great Sunday, and let's get into it. So first things off, unfortunately, I already did this. Um... I feel kind of silly now not actually uh, recording that but you do get a free 10 pool on this banner so basically uh, it says 10 free summons to co um, commemorate the completion of Makai Senkai Disgaea 4 a read collection of Makai history is being held uh, once during <clears throat> the period and so it's once only uh, 10 summons that only the characters of Disgaea 4 are discharged can be used for free how four star is confirmed at least one so you get one four star from it uh, it's a one-time pull unfortunately I, I know it says 10 but I, I think they mean like 10 free summons as in like it's a multi uh, with each unit being a separate summon so yes we already did it I actually pulled Artina which was actually pretty nice so I did get a dupe of Artina which was very poggers uh, very happy about that one so if you guys haven't done so or you guys have not started playing JP that's not a bad time you get a free summon on top of your normal summon and yeah i mean i got Artina off it you have a chance of pulling any of these other gals and boys and it's pretty cool so um not many complaints on that um you could probably use the twitter because the twitter is like a bit more organized uh here's the login bonus i actually was recording a video with me showing you guys the login bonus but like a freaking doorknob i forgot i my recording actually i forgot to post it hey it was so, uh, you know, here is the login bonus. You know, you're getting 100 nether crystals every day, um, some items. So it's pretty cool. Uh, just kind of general stuff to give you an idea. So you're getting 500 nether crystals for a couple days. Uh, they did give this on the original login day, I believe. The outside is damp, the rainy season. The sky campaign is underway at home. You get items by logging in. So they give you 200,000 hell, uh, behavior, power, uh, 150 times seven, and like luxury. Uh, tamale and dark scape take uh dark dark gate skip ticket sorry oh my gosh i'm sorry guys it's four in the morning i should not be up right now i should definitely be sleeping so um it's a little unfortunate and then over here we have another little campaign uh three campaigns are being held at the same time so we have an innocent removal free agenda campaign which is sick that's awesome so take advantage of that uh this one's the biggest right here so i am going to be literally on 24 7 trying to get more items now because that is fantastic. So item more equipment drop rate up campaign. So uh, you know, make sure to do that. And then you got item hori hori campaign. So um, it's pretty nice. Definitely not a bad time to you know jump in there, get your item world grinding up. Because having that rate up campaign is going to be very, very exquisite. It's very cool. So let me see what else we currently got. I think that's all the main stuff for the most part. So we could go back to the normal game. Uh, but what, is, what was this? A special Rough Night Edition, Razor X, and Boss, and Mr. Frank, the challenge. Um, I'm, yeah, I think that's, no, yeah, that is part of the celebration. I just don't, I just don't remember what the hell that was in game. Uh, I'll, I'll go ahead and jump into that. And then, yeah, I mean, th there wasn't really a whole lot else. Um, so let's go ahead and actually show you guys the banners and stuff like that. So let me actually move my thing over and we'll get out of twitter uh sorry for like the jumping around and stuff but it is what it is so right now they have these cool like uh these cool 1.5 banners so basically how it works it's like you could get printies um you could get mana potions you get these things you know rainbow printies so it's not a bad um way to summon and then obviously these are characters uh but that's pretty much everything that they have up right now there's no new unit at the moment which is nice i mean i'll take that taking a break from summoning is nice uh so you know this is pretty much it a lot, but these are like the paid bands that they got going on right now probably want to suggest it because you really want these i mean that, that's a lot uh you do need those man you do need a lot of those so that's not like really a bad deal to be honest that's pretty i mean i could use 75 of those to be honest bro i would be pretty happy if i got a bunch of them uh, but yeah, that's pretty much uh, how all the banners work. They have a paid and a 
free one. So uh, over here, you get the rainbow uh, printing hides, which is pretty sick. Uh, and overall, just kind of looking at it, you know, these are, this is it. You know, there's not much else going on. I'm sure we're going to get... I wonder if we'll get, like, some type of Disgaea 4 unit, uh, right? That would be kind of interesting if they decided to say, hey, we're going to give you guys a Disgaea 4 unit. Um, and, yeah, so let's go ahead and keep rocking and rolling here. we got to kind of keep seeing uh, what's going on. Uh, let me show you that Killua event, because I actually haven't done it yet. Um, will that just take me to it? Yeah. So you could... You could do it five times. Obviously, oh yeah, I did it one time. So we'll do this one. And unfortunately, I'm on blue stack, so I can't actually figure out what the hell I need. But I'm sure I'm gonna need something, and I will have to get translations for that. Unfortunately, um, yeah, I'm sure I, something's gonna be required here. Obviously, um, so I do apologize for that. I wish I had a translator, but unfortunately, the boy doesn't at the very moment. But this is the event, and you need some type of something. So, uh, if I, I wish I was in my freaking blue stacks. So let's kind of look around. I think that's like primarily it, though. The celebration's not like too crazy. We did get a new Nether history, I believe. That's what it mentioned. Or I think this guy Ford's been here for a while. I just haven't done it yet. I think I've seen it here. Uh, there might be a new chapter or something. I think that's what I read. But um, that is pretty much it i mean there's not really a whole lot going on um which is nice i mean it's kind of like a it's like a teeny tiny break from all the craziness they had like six freaking banners up so this is going till the 11th so that gives us like like five more days so like a new unit drops or they might get crazy and drop a new unit right now i don't know this guy uh, they are uh they're all over the place to say the very least man so uh if you guys want to start playing though um you could definitely you know make an account and do get that free multi if you guys want to. Oh, you know, I actually pulled a four star from this uh, the other day, which is pretty cool. But um, if you guys want to play, I mean, right now, it's kind of like not the greatest time to start. But if you want to get that free multi in with like the four stars, I mean, with uh, characters from the sky at four, you guys could definitely go ahead and do so if you want to. Uh, you could definitely skip it or just kind of like come back maybe like on a second year anniversary. Because I do think you do need to use a VPN now, which is a little unfortunate. So it is what it is, though. Um, but there's not really like a lot of uh, a lot of crazy content as of right now, which is good. Uh, besides the item world, item world campaign is going to be pretty nice. So we want to make sure to take advantage of that. I'm going to be taking advantage, and I'm sure Hazink and everyone else who plays JP, we got to do it. So if you guys want to play, go go for it. If not keep enjoying the global stuff, and now you know that at some point we'll be getting this in the future. So uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. It's great to have you guys here. As always, have a great Sunday. I'll see you guys tomorrow for the next Sky RPG video. Take care and peace out. Bye.